Other news now, a year after a shooting rocked a Westchester neighborhood, today prosecutors charged a Yonkers woman with trying to kill her husband. She works for the NYPD. CBS 2's Lou Young was there when she turned herself in. She's interviewed would-be police officers in her job at the NYPD, but now psychologist Emily Dearden was heading to be booked and charged by cops for attempted murder. The wife and mother of two surrendered to Yonkers detectives early Friday morning, charged with trying to kill her husband, developer Kenneth Dearden, he says, because she wanted to be with a new boyfriend. Her lawyer says it isn't so. With every fiber of her body and every resource that she has, she's going to be fighting these baseless charges. Police say she shot her husband in their bedroom as he slept just over a year ago, then tried to make it look like an intruder had done it. Kenneth Dearden survived a bullet wound to the head and neck and says he began to regard her with suspicion as time went on. In court papers filed two weeks ago, he says he discovered his wife's boyfriend came from New York to Texas about the time of the shooting, pressuring her to end their marriage. We're told Emily and Kenneth Dearden and their two daughters, ages 11 and 14, have all been living in the same house for the past year, the scene of the crime. The judges set her bail now at $150,000 and ordered her to stay away from the house, the husband, and the girls. She plans to go to family court to get visitation rights while the criminal case proceeds. This is a loving mother. She's a wonderful mother. And no court that reviews what has gone on with this family will will put any kind of restrictions on her. A Derringer belonging to Dearden was recovered from the home, but ballistics are inconclusive. She's due back in court just before Christmas. We're in Yonkers, Lou Young, CBS 2 News. Emily Dearden filed for divorce from her husband over the summer. She was put on administrative duty at the NYPD after the shooting.